No, this video is not sponsored. Hotlook doesn't even know I exist. Well, they might since I purchase from them all the time, but you know what I mean. Hi everyone. So for today's video, I have a small beauty haul from Hotlook.com. If you guys have never heard of Hotlook, what are you doing? You guys are missing out. It is a website, well, it's an app and a website that has name brand items for like probably about, I'd say, half the price. They're all super, super discounted, and you can get some really great stuff for really great deals. I purchase off of Hotlook all the time. It's slightly a problem. They have items up on the website for, you know, a certain amount of days, usually like three days, and then they rotate to new brands. If you see something you like, just know there's only a certain quantity that they're going to sell, and it's only gonna be for a few days, so you better buy it when you see it, otherwise, gonna slip right through those fingers of yours. The only thing that I would say irritates me about Hot Look is that I think they wait like two weeks before they ship the items out so you can order today and you might not get your stuff for like a good three weeks which honestly doesn't bother me because I forget about it and then it's like a surprise three weeks later I'm like oh <laughs> Forgot I ordered you. Definitely get on Hotlook and give it a look to see all the different things they have. And like I said, about every three days they rotate to new brands, so you always have to go on and go check for new items. If you guys think you're interested in signing up for Hotlook, definitely click the link down below and give it a go. You guys will not be disappointed, I promise. Okay, so let's go ahead and start off with the very first brand that I purchased from on Hotlook, and that is Lime Crime. You heard me right, Lime Crime. I have always wanted to try the Lime Crime lipsticks and liquid lipsticks, but you know, they're just so expensive and I just wasn't feeling it. So when I saw that they were half off, I said, gimme. Before we go any further, yes, I've already heard about the Lime Crime controversy. I read about two sentences in and I said, <laughs> I really don't care. So let's move on. So I picked up, let's see, one, two, three, four, five lip products. And I will just go one by one. The first one is a lipstick in the color Babette, Babette. Maybe it's Babette. I think it is Babette. And I just absolutely love the packaging. Like, how cute can you get? It's like a purpley pink packaging with a silver unicorn and silver stars. It says Lime Crime on it. And this color is just like a peachy kind of nude color. And it is just super pretty, especially for the summertime. I have not yet worn any of these on the lips, so I will be sure to let you guys know how they feel on the lips, how they wear throughout the day. But as far as right now, I really have no idea. Um, apparently I got another one in Babette, so whoopsies, I think I accidentally ordered two of those. Okay, and then the next one that I got is in the color, I cannot pronounce any of these, Coquette, C-O-Q-U-E-T-T-E, -E. and this one, same packaging, and this one is more of just a like nude color, and it is so flippin' beautiful. So it is that one right there. It is so, so pretty, and I cannot wait to try this one. I've been really into like the nude, nude colored lips lately, and I don't know why. Okay, the next one is called Unicorn Lipstick in the color Eraser. And I'm pretty sure this is another nude with that name. It's like, I don't even remember what I ordered. Is that a problem? Same exact packaging, except um, it's a bigger unicorn and it says Lime Crime this way. Once again, it's in the color Eraser. And what do you know? It is another nude color. Ooh, I like that one. That's like a nude, like pink color. These three colors are pretty similar, but I mean, you can definitely tell a difference uh, once they're applied. And then what I'm probably most excited for, this is the Lime Crime Velveteen in the color Shroom. So it's like a really pretty, like brown color and this is a liquid lipstick so this is what the packaging looks like it looks like a little like lip gloss tube with a pink top with little roses on it and oh this color gives me life this is it's just a really pretty nude brown color and like I said it's like a liquid lipstick so I'm super excited to be wearing this one that's right up my alley, so I'm really, really excited to wear that. Like I said, all of these were, I, th I believe, half off. If not, they were more than half off, so that's why I bought so many of them. The next brand that I ordered from was Morphe. 
Um, I ordered the face brush set and then a single um, like foundation brush. And they all came in this really cute little black zipper pouch. So let me show you. I chose the white ones. They did have different colors. Um, I chose the white and silver because everything in my room is white and silver and I just thought it would look really pretty sitting in my um, makeup brush holder. So let's go through these one by one. I don't think there's a name on them, but this is just a dome shaped um, foundation kabuki brush. And then this one is like a slanted kabuki brush. And these are very dense, perfect, perfect, perfect for liquid foundation. Um, they just say Morphe on them in silver on the side. The next one is this like pointed kabuki brush. Perfect for like getting under your eyes and patting in concealer. I can already tell what I'm gonna use these for. It's unreal. And then it came with three um, precision face brushes. These are really good for concealer or even for like contouring your nose or honestly even eyeshadow. So they're pretty much the exact same as these ones, but just smaller. So we have the domed brush, the slanted, and then the pointer brush. So it came with six brushes. Once again, I can't remember how much they were, but I believe they were super cheap. I want to say they were like $15 for all of these. So that's a really good deal. Um, so yeah, there's those. And then the last brush that I got from Morphe is so cute. It is metallic silver. And it is the Morphe G6 brush. And it is just a smaller flat top kabuki brush, perfect for foundations or any type of liquid products. This would honestly even be good for contouring because it's smaller than a normal foundation brush. So yeah, these were all of the makeup and beauty products that I got from Hot Look. Like I said, definitely go sign up because you can sign up for free and then you don't have to buy anything unless you absolutely see something that you're in love with. But definitely go sign up and if you do see something, purchase it, girly girl, because that deal, ugh, deal of a lifetime, I'm telling you. And they have some really cute home decor stuff that I'm, ugh, it's really getting me in trouble. My bank account is hurting. I'm planning on moving soon, like I've said a million times and that home decor section is just really cute stuff. So definitely go sign up. And if you have any questions about any of these products, leave them down below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.